Ladies and gentlemen, there's an epidemic happening on the internet right now, and it's more dangerous than any bacterial infection or virus that humanity has ever known. It's motherfucking clout. And now y'all might be thinking, hey, clout chasers have been around for a while now, why are you bringing them up now? Cause yeah, they have and I think a lot of them are fucking cringe, but now there's these type of new clout chasers that aren't just cringe, but fucking deadly too. And these are the clout chasers that do pranks, but not just any pranks. Pranks that are literally threatening people. Whether these people are breaking and entering homes, or they're going to pretend to stab you and literally telling you to die. These fucking idiots pose a threat to other people and themselves as well. These dudes are like if clout chasers and prank channels had a baby, and they just gave that baby fucking cocaine. These dudes are a menace to society, and I'm talking about them today because there's this one motherfucker that did a dumping gasoline on people's cars prank. And you might think that this prank does not sound good at all, while well, it fucking isn't because you're pretending you're dumping gasoline, a very flammable liquid, on people's cars. And if you think that's bad, he's even pretending he's dumping it on the people as well. Come on, man. Burning your car down, bro. Fuck your car, man. Over. All of this. Yeah. Uh-huh. Why you wanna do it? Come on, man. <laughs> Come on, man. Come on, man. Come on, man. I don't know who this dude is, but fuck you, man. What the fuck is this? This dude just goes up to some old guy in the Best Buy parking lot and just starts pretending that he's dumping gasoline all over this dude's car and starts saying like, hey, I'ma burn everything, it's over. And this poor old dude's just there like, dang, what the fuck, I'ma call the cops and shit. At least that's what I'm assuming what he's doing on his phone. But my boy the prankster here decides, you know what, this ain't enough. Let me go make this dude fear for his fucking life by pretending to dump gasoline on him. Like, what the fuck, this old dude was probably just here, you know, at the local Best Buy to buy a new charger or something for his phone. And then all of a sudden, some random fucking prick is dumping gasoline all over his car and him. Well, at the end of that clip, the dude says it's just water, but like, he just ruined this dude's day. He feared for his fucking life. And all this clout chaser did was just laugh and be like, it's a prank bro, it's just water. This dude has to be like some sociopath or something, maybe like he has some severe social media and TikTok brain rot. Cause shit like this isn't funny, it's just fucking stupid, it makes you look stupid. And makes you look talentless cause it shows to me that the only way that you can get some sort of audience is by threatening people, causing a fucking scene. Like, that shit's not okay. But anyways, there's another clip of him doing this to another old guy. And before I play it, I must say that this dude's obviously looking for people that he knows can't really fuck him up. Seems like he's going after old people and shit. But this dude's gonna be in for the surprise of a lifetime, cause what this old dude does next is fucking insane. It better be water, partner, or you're one dead son of a bitch. You stay out of this. Yeah, I don't think you want to do that. I don't want to do that. You almost died, you stupid son of a bitch. Fuck you, pussy. My boy really thought that he could just go up to some old dude that has a black Ford and his license plate is L7 Ranch and not almost die. Like, before I start calling this dude stupid as fuck, like, what did he expect to happen? You go up to someone like that and you do your fake pouring gasoline on people's car prank and not think that this dude's probably strapped? Like, what the fuck? But anyways, this dude's stupid as fuck and is also a humongous pussy too. Like, it's obvious he's trying to, like, look for people that really can't defend themselves. And the second someone is able to defend themselves, he runs off. You can't just be like, hey, I'm pouring gasoline on your car, ha ha ha, this is funny, right? Brother, it's not funny. It's exactly like what that old dude just said. You almost died, you stupid son of a bitch. 
And the funny thing is, I don't even find the fact that he pulled a gun out surprising. What surprises me the most is that he didn't just gun down the motherfucker like right then and there. I'm assuming he had a good day or something, cause if he had like even somewhat of a bad of a day, and he sees some dude just, you know, pouring gasoline on his truck, I'm assuming he would just gun him down no questions asked. And I wouldn't blame him cause that shit's fucking insane. And my god, the irony of this dude calling him a fucking pussy at the end. It's just fucking insane. Like you go up to some random dude, you pretend to pour gasoline all over his car, he pulls a gun on you, which is a very reasonable response to that, and you run away like a little bitch. And at the end when he finally puts the gun away, you call him a pussy. My brother in Christ, you're the pussy and you're the dumbass. I have no idea who this dude is, but I hope to God that he has no platform. Or if he does, I hope to God that it's not growing, because people like this should not have a platform or an audience at all. And the worst part about this is, this shit is becoming more common now. I've just seen a lot of fucking videos of these dudes saying, Hey, it's just a prank bro, when they're doing the most heinous and most fucking insane shit imaginable. Like, brother, you're not pranking anyone, you're just harassing people and committing crimes. I wouldn't be surprised if people have already died doing these prank videos because, you know, they just messed with the wrong person. Like, this type of content needs to be stopped. It's not funny, it's just dangerous, it puts the pranksters at risk, and also the people at risk. But honestly, I mainly care about the victims in this video. I wouldn't want them to commit a murder that's over something fucking stupid. And honestly, whatever happens to the pranksters, those clout chasers, I really don't have any sympathy for them. It's just fucking natural selection at this point. But still, I don't think this type of content should have any type of platform. This type of content should not thrive, and I would recommend anyone seeing this type of content to just dislike it, report it, or something, I don't know. Cause these aren't just pranks, these are crimes waiting to happen. And some good people might get hurt, or do some hurting. Anyways, I think that's enough of me talking for today. I just wanted to talk about this since I thought this shit was fucking stupid. And I've been seeing a lot of this type of content more recently, and I honestly fucking hate it. But yeah, anyways, hope y'all have a good rest of your day, and bye bye adios